morning, Andrew. Hey, good morning. Tell me, how can I help you best today? It's my lower back pain. As uh, like about two years ago, I did an MRI test, mm -hmm. and it shows that I have a 1.5 millimeter protrusion. Mm -hmm. So it's very small, but you know, I feel sometimes I feel pain, like mm -hmm. really bad pain, especially in the morning time. Mm -hmm. When I wake up, I have to do some stretches. It helps me, you know, to relieve the pain a little bit. But still, if I sit a lot the whole day or I walk a lot, I mean, when my position is vertigo, mm -hmm. that makes me, you know, some discomfort in the end of the day. I feel okay. bad. And also, uh, my right shoulder, mm -hmm. I feel like uh, it's kind of really tough or something like that. Because I used to be a window cleaner for a long time, so mm -hmm. I work with my right hand a lot. Mm -hmm. And now, I feel like my left hand can reach more than my right hand. Okay. So that's the main thing. Well, let's that. talk about the 1.5 millimeter protrusion. Do you, know, do you remember where it was? That's uh, L5S1. Do you ever have any numbness or tingling in your leg? Do you ever have any pain down the back of your leg? Maybe about two years ago. What treatments did you do for it? Did you do anything after the MRI? Uh, well, I had some like physical trainings and you know some stretches in the morning. Uh, also, I had like a two weeks therapy okay. with the physician, mm -hmm. and after that, that was that's it. Pretty simple. Good. Yeah, and so at this point, that 1.5 millimeter protrusion, it, it may not be protruding anymore. When you have a disc bulge, they can suck back in. So is it consistent that every time you have, uh, that you work for a long period of time, it'll happen? Basically, yeah. Okay. So when I'm having more day offs, when I'm you know lying back, chilling, relaxing, mm -hmm. not doing something uh, hard, I mean, long periods of standing or sitting at the same place, mm -hmm. that it's feel okay. And your shoulder? Yeah, my right shoulder. Is that every day as well? Well, the thing is, I don't feel uh, I don't feel like straight pain, but I just feel it's like not not stretchy enough or something like that. Comparing to the left side, because mm -hmm. the left side I can reach a lot more. Especially I feel it when I'm taking the shower in the end of the day mm -hmm. or morning time. So you know when I wash my back with the left hand, I can reach all over here. Gotcha. When I'm using my right hand, it just when I'm trying to stretch it more, then I start to feel pain. Gotcha. Has there been any other trauma, accidents, or injuries that you can recall? Any car accidents, sports injuries? No, no, not at all. Okay. How about um, when you were a kid? Did you have any um, asthma, allergies? No. I grew up pretty health guy, so... Good. So you don't take any medications right now? No. No. Do you take any supplements? No. No. Okay. okay. How's your diet? Uh, pretty, I uh, would we'll call it normal. I mean, try not to, to eat a lot of fat things and uh, bad stuff. Veggies, fruits, uh, meat, fish, eggs, you know, standard. Very good. I would call it standard. Okay. How much water do you drink a day? Water? Mm -hmm. uh, that's about, uh, I mean, two, two liters. That's uh, a little bit less than a gallon. Okay. Okay, very good. Uh, and digestion? How's your digestion? It's fine. Good. Yep. All right. So, have you ever been to a chiropractor before? Yes. Yes, I had. Uh, probably, that was maybe like six or seven years ago. That was in Ukraine, actually. Mm -hmm. Okay. Do you have anything else that you think is valuable? Anything else I need to know? Your ankles, your knees, any pain there? No, pretty much the rest of the things are fine. Good. Wrists, elbows? No. Do you get headaches ever? No, you know, that's that's that I'm not suffering for. Yeah. Okay. Very good. Okay, let's do an exam on your back. Let's see what your spine says and then I'll get you adjusted, okay? Yep. Thank you. Okay, let me...
much more on this right side, increased heat in the shoulder area, top right shoulder blade here, increased heat. A little bit of edema on the right SI. Okay, bend forward. Gotta keep going. Good, now come back. Forward. Back. Got one more time forward. Back. Okay, now bend to the left. Right, left, left, right. More movement to the right, which we which would mean this is the side of the open wedge. And potentially the bulge when it does happen. Increase muscle tone here on the right side. Moderate. I'm just going to measure out L4, 5. And then go ahead and march in place, just walk in place. Higher knees. Good movement on both sides. Keep going. Okay, I'm gonna put my fingers on the back of your hamstrings now, okay? You're gonna feel my fingers. I'm gonna test the glute fiber. So we're gonna find out where the glute fold is. Pretty even. I would say it's maybe slightly lower on the left. Looking from the top, definite external rotation here on the right side, flattening on the left. Possible IN on the left, good. Looks like pronation on the left foot. Slight decrease in the arch with an IN. Slight decrease in lumbar lordosis, which means the AEX would be prominent. So let's take a look at it lying down. Okay, Andrew, I wanna push down into your hips now, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, do you have any pain when I push here? No. Nope. Here. No. Do you have any pain here? No. Here? No. Here? No. Good. Any tenderness, left or right? Maybe a little bit on right. Right side. Okay, so let's do this. Keeping your leg straight, lift the whole leg in the air. Go down. Relax your back. Good. Left, down, right, perfect, down, left lumbar is firing, good, left, down, one more time, relax your back, good, left, down, okay. Okay, let's lift your left hip up just a little bit. Go down, a little bit down.
tender. A little bit. Okay, we're gonna do a little stretch here. Nice and gentle.
Come in. Hello. Greetings. Absolutely, yes. So what you're going to do is you're going to breathe in through your nose and out through your mouth. And I will follow your breath down like this. And then at the end of your breath, I'm going to push in that direction, okay? All right. Okay. Okay, nice and gentle. Breathing in and out. Good. Let the shirt sinking in. Let the shoulders relax. Okay, good. Deep breath in. And out. Lean back. Good. Good. One more. Let this go. Good. What we're going to do for this one is I'm going to bring your hip down like this. And then when we get to right about here, we're just going to stretch in that direction and then push like that, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, three, two, deep breath in and out. Good, we'll bring this down, good. Beautiful. Okay, so this is how we adjust the lumbar spine. Very similar, we're gonna bring the hips down to about there and then we're gonna push like that right here, okay? Mm -hmm. Do you stretch like this in the morning? Do you do this stretch where you lay and you do the side? Yeah, a little bit different way, but okay, close. a little bit similar. Yeah, close. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Now, same thing. Breathe. Out. Good. Again, in and out. Good. Okay, let's do this now. Turn your head to the right. Good, back to center. Now turn your head to the left. Back to center. Tuck your chin to your chest. Good, back to center is perfect. Okay, now push your head straight back. Good, but don't lift your chin, yes. Good, relax. Okay, beautiful.
It's gonna be gentle and soft. All you have to do is breathe. Good, and down, that's perfect. Good breath there, just stay with the flow of the breath in and out. Good, just letting everything drop into the table as you breathe out. That was perfect right there. Good, gentle, gentle little pushing. Good, let it go. <laughs> wow. Good. Okay, let's do the left side now. Now, just kind of like let your head, let me do all the work. All right. I'll move the head and so I'm going to test first and see where we need to adjust. So just kind of sink in here. Good. Seven, six, five, four, three. Now. Good. Let your neck completely relax. Let your head just sink in. We're just pushing, just testing. Seven. Right at five. So let your head drop in and let your shoulders drop in too. That's good. Good. One more time. Let this go. Now the next one, I'm just going to lift your head like this. And then we're going to pull in this direction, okay? Nice and gentle. Let your shoulders relax. Good. Let this go. Okay, squeeze. Okay, deep breath in through your nose. Good and out. Okay, this time when you breathe in, fill your belly with air. Like, fill your belly up. There you go. Out. Again. Out. Again. Keep going. Go ahead and reach back with your hand, your left hand. There you go. Now do the same thing with the right. Let the left hand go down. Right hand up. Okay, not much difference. Okay, relax. This, let this relax. Okay, bring your left hand to the small of your back again. I'm sorry, right hand. Okay, good. Good, let this relax.
When you were washing windows, did you have to wash like skyscrapers? Yeah, I did. How high? Uh, the highest one was 40, 44, 45 stories. <laughs> <laughs> Scared at all? Is, is it scary at all? No, what? I mean, if you if you are if you scare of heights, you just simply <laughs> cannot do this job. Let the sun completely relax. There you go. Have you ever considered any healing profession? Have you ever done any massage for people or any Reiki? Do you know what Reiki is? Well, I did massage. I mean, for my wife, for some friends, just sometimes. Uh -huh. This is actually a really beautiful meditation. If you take your fingers here and put them here, Andre. Oh, uh, sorry, Andre. Is that your Ukrainian name, Andrew? Well, it's pronounced actually Andri. Andri. Yeah. But, mm -hmm. you know, here it's easier to say Andrew or Andy or mm -hmm. Andre. Well, Andre. doesn't matter for me. I love it, Andre.
Isn't it strange how I just called you Andre for just randomly? I never, I haven't said that once. I just said Andre, and I was just like, you know what? Your name probably is not Andrew in Ukrainian, and I was pretty close to it. Yeah. Even though I misspoke. It's it's Andre on, on Russian, it's Andrei, actually. Mm, okay. So it's more close to that one. I gotcha. Let's take a look. Go ahead and stand up. Take it for a test drive. That's feel beautiful. <laughs> yeah, good. You got it nice and smooth? Yeah. I feel uplifting. Good. Yeah. That's beautiful. <laughs> Your responses are great, man. It's a beautiful language. It was a pleasure. Yeah. Uh -huh. Thank good. you so much. Very good. Yes, you're welcome.